the Worldview 3 satellite passes high above the Australian outback. It picks up a baffling pattern of black spots in the desert sand. They look like big black holes in the middle of the desert. These really stand out from everything else. They could be small bodies of water, like ponds or something like that. The image comes from near the isolated opal mining colony of Cooper Pedy, on the edge of one of the most barren landscapes on Earth, the Great Victoria Desert. This is right in the middle of the driest desert of the driest state and the driest continent in the world. Very few people have been to Cooper Pedy, but the select few who know its secret come for a very specific reason. They come to play golf. The black circles are in fact part of one of the hottest golf courses in the world. It was created in 1976 when sports mad locals came up with the idea to make grassless greens. It is strange, but when you're down at ground level, it all makes sense because put greens out here would be too expensive for the amount of water that we'd need to keep them looking nice. Instead of grass, the greens are made of sand rolled with black motor oil to stop it from blowing away in windy weather. You use a rake to rake where you're going to putt. And you scrape the dirt back so the next people have got a sort of even place to putt on. During the summer months, it gets even weirder. It's too hot during the day, so we come out at night and use glow-in-the-dark balls. You can see them for two, three hundred metres away. They're good to play, it's good fun, and it's nice and cool at night. It's a uniquely Australian answer to the question of golf in the desert. Why would you go through all the trouble of pumping water to make your greens green when black sand will do? I guess black is the new green. <laughs> 